I have the blues is an idiomatic expression often used to describe a state of emotional or psychological distress, sadness, or melancholy. This phrase originates from the world of music, particularly from the genre known as the blues, which is characterized by its soulful and often sorrowful melodies. To say, I have the blues, is to convey that you are feeling down, disheartened, or experiencing a period of emotional turmoil. When someone says they have the blues, it's important to note that it is not a reference to a medical condition, but rather an emotional state. This feeling can be triggered by various life events, such as personal setbacks, relationship problems, work-related stress, or even a general sense of unhappiness without a specific cause. The blues can manifest differently in individuals, with some feeling a persistent sense of sadness and others experiencing it intermittently. The term's connection to music is noteworthy. The blues genre, which originated in African-American communities in the United States, often explores themes of hardship, adversity, and sorrow. Musicians use the blues to express their emotional struggles and experiences. Listening to blues music can be a cathartic experience for many people, as it allows them to connect with and process their own feelings of sadness or melancholy. Having the blues is a universal human experience, and it's important to acknowledge and address these feelings, rather than suppressing them. People may have the blues for a variety of reasons, including personal losses, disappointments, or even the cumulative effects of daily stressors. It's a reminder that we all face challenges and periods of emotional difficulty in life. Addressing the blues often involves self-care and seeking support from friends, family, or mental health professionals. Engaging in activities that bring joy, such as hobbies or spending time with loved ones, can help alleviate feelings of sadness. Additionally, practicing mindfulness, relaxation techniques, or even seeking therapy can provide valuable tools for managing the blues. It's worth noting that the blues can also serve as a source of inspiration and creativity for some individuals. Many famous artists, writers, and musicians have drawn from their own experiences with sadness or melancholy to create meaningful works of art. In this sense, the blues can be a catalyst for personal growth and self-expression. In conclusion, saying I have the blues is a figurative way to express a state of emotional distress or sadness. It draws from the musical genre of the same name, which has historically been a powerful medium for conveying the human experience of hardship and sorrow. While having the blues is a natural part of life, it's essential to recognize these feelings, seek support when needed, and find healthy ways to navigate through them. Just as in music, acknowledging the blues can lead to personal growth, healing, and even artistic expression.